talking with Ashley Hegedren from the Iowa State Cyclones, a senior this year, Ashley. Uh, last year, your first year in the program, now going into your second year. Uh, what's the transition been like, and what's different this year for you? This year's a little bit different. You know, I'm a senior now and uh, know the ropes and can help the younger girls get where they need to be and just, you know, do my part and try to lead them to you know, a good example and show them how it's done. What have you been doing in practice so far this year uh, and what are some of the things you're kind of focusing on? Um, personally, you know, I've just been on defense helping, you know, doing whatever they ask, but uh, just kind of helping the freshmen transition, you know, letting them feel how it's like. You know, I made the transition last year, so it's still fresh, so I am able to help them out that way. What are some of the things that you talk to the freshmen about, about that transition? Uh, it's a different pace, for sure, you know, coming from high school to this, it's totally different. You know, it's the same way coming from a JUCO to D1, but, you know, Try your best, give a good effort, that's all you can do. What have you seen from the Cyclone so far in practice and what kind of stands out for you? Uh, we like to run. We're smaller, but it'll be good. You know, a little different tempo and lots of threes, so that's good. Does that fit your style a little does. bit? Yeah. I like it. Yeah, I, I know that uh, you're rooming with two of what become two of your very best friends. Talk about that. They're two girls really from kind of our area as well. Yep, small uh, southwestern girls. and. You know, we got Hallie, and she's got a lot of pressure this year to do big things. And Ellie, you know, she's kind of there by with me, with me too, uh, senior role, but not as big a part to play as Hallie does. But it's fun, you know, to go every day with these two girls, and it's fun to have the experience together. And Nice. Talk about rooming with Hallie. She just gets named preseason all-conference today and going to be one of the best players in the conference. Uh, what do you talk to her about? What are some of the things and, and some of the information that she passes along to you? She's the most humble person you'll meet. You know, you just go back to the apartment and you wouldn't know anything different. And we rarely even talk about basketball. It's kind of weird, but she's so busy with her graphic design work. It's just fun to watch her be creative off the floor and see what she does. And, She's amazing on and off. Ashley, for you, last year it was a goal to play here. And when I talked to you at this event last year, you, you really hadn't had a chance to kind of soak in what it was like. Now that you're second year in the program, what does being a Cyclone really mean to you and, and how much have you enjoyed this so far? Oh, it's meant everything to me. You know, it, fulfilling a dream is just huge. It's still it's hard to believe. But, I mean, what these teammates and coaches and the university have done for me, I mean, I can't even thank them enough. Talk about your senior year. What's your goals for this year? Let's start with on the basketball court. Okay, on the court, I mean, NCAA tournament again. Um, get pretty far there. Big 12 conference, you know, we would like to be up top there again. And just have a fun year. Make the most of it. Now, I know that you want to set an example for the young girls. It's something that I think you take a lot of pride in. Why is that, and, and what kind of example do you want to be? I think just it's important to be an example because, you know, you have – two and three other girls that look up to you and they'll continue to do that throughout the years and I mean we had great leaders last year you know Poppins and Z and uh, Anna and you know I learned a lot from them and I just want to continue to pass it on. What are some of the things that you've done maybe with little kids and stuff especially little girls uh, you know to try and cut, help lead them in the right direction? Just you know set a good example I think it's so hard to do in high school you have so many different pressures to do different things and you know, to stay on the right track, show them that, you know, keeping your head in the right direction and anything you want to achieve, you can. I think that's huge. Where do you feel you've grown the most, first as a basketball player and then as a person since coming to Iowa State? I just love the game more. You know, Coach Finley just ingrains it in you and it's, you live it every day, but I love it. And then personally, I think I've just grown up more. Just being responsible, having, you know, more leadership roles to play and responsibilities, but it's good. It'll all work out for the future. What's the future hold for you? That's a good question. I don't really know for sure. Just kind of playing things by ear right now. Okay. I have some options, but looking at maybe getting away out of Iowa for a little bit, but maybe coming back. I don't know. We'll see. Any coaching in the future for you? Probably not. No. Probably not, huh? <laughs> Maybe, you know, I'll be that sucker like my mom was and coach little kids when I have a little kid, but that's going to be for a long time. We won't have to worry about that. <laughs> uh, tell us about uh, classes. How's school going for you right now? It's going good. Um, I don't have senior writers quite yet, so that's good. But classes, I'm, you know, getting into more of my marketing classes. So that's 
fun not to have to take math and science and stuff that you don't normally want to take. So it's fun, you know, being able to get closer to the degree. So. Any other high school girls out there that are thinking about coming to Iowa State, why would you tell them to come here? It's a great place. I mean, um, everyone around you here is helpful. The coaches are awesome. The teammates are awesome. Ames is just an awesome town. Um, and it's like a little family. It is. Well, Ashley, I appreciate you joining us. Best of luck coming up this year. Thank you.